five. Bobby, you want it? Huh? I'm gonna keep it for myself.
God damn it, I don't believe this. Honey, I have to pee. He was supposed to finish this job a goddamn month ago. The house goes on the block tomorrow. Yeah, I could have finished this job myself in a day. <laughs> yeah, right. What? <laughs> thinking about you don't even know <laughs> hurry up oh shit he didn't close the door much less lock it how the fuck do some people Alan. get by i'm well, sorry but jesus here take this you have the tea you have the tea yeah, you are so mean. will you make me a cup of that uh, hot apple spice wow. tea <laughs> She's a fucking idiot. We tracked mud in upstairs. Yeah. Well, you know what? We're selling the place, so let it be somebody else's problem, okay? Well, no, it's just not right when you pay someone good money. Yeah. You know what? I'm gonna go lay down, okay? Okay, I'll be up in a minute. Don't even think about it. <laughs> I just want to kiss no. your neck. I mean, come on. I love you. I'm neck. supposed to rest. You know, I think your doctor is turning you into a hypochondriac. <sighs> it's a natural thing for a hundred million years. Yeah, I thought you were a lawyer. What are you, a doctor now, too? <sighs> Listen, Amy. What? Nothing's going to happen this late in the pregnancy. <laughs> I don't feel sexy. Why don't you just put Mr. Happy away? <laughs> well, where are you going? I thought you wanted to take a nap. I did. But now Mr. Happy and I want to take a shower. Alan? 
Say hello to Sherry. Oh, well, uh, come on in. Nice to meet you. <laughs> hey, I thought I heard somebody. Oh, Amy, it's Bill, uh, and, uh... Sherry, Sherry, your place is great, really. Thanks. I'm uh, sorry we're late, uh, but they got a bunch of damn roadblocks out there and shit. Mm. Can I get you two something to drink? Yeah, is a frog's ass water tight? I know you want Chevis and Sherry, what would you like? Uh, just a Coke. A Coke, that's okay. all. Why don't you two put your things upstairs? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, uh, Sherry, uh, your room's the first door on the left, top of the stairs, huh? Thanks. All right. Yo, oh, right up there. <laughs> You knew about this. How would I know? Huh? No, baby, I swear. This is much a surprise to me as it is to you. How can you do this to Lori? Bill's a little different, huh? Yeah. He's from uh, his thinking. He's, uh, he's going through, uh, he's an asshole. What can I say? Look, I'm not trying to get down. Oh, it sounds like it's a me. Do you think that's funny? Um. Yeah, you know, maybe we should get you a little bimbo, too. What do you say? Huh? Can you tell me where the bath towels are? Bath towels would be in the bathroom. Uh, uh, under the sink. Thank you. Look, I, I don't think it's funny. Uh, I love you. <laughs> Even if you do look like the Goodyear bull. <laughs> yeah, no, I hear her. Here. No, here. Oh, you're good, though. Sorry. Did you want to come up for air? <laughs> Here you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, thanks, Ames. Uh, you Here are you a go. doll. Oh, here. Son, you did all right with this one. That's for damn sure. <laughs> well, I'm going to be a good little woman and get right back in the kitchen. <laughs> oh, come on now. Sit down here. Sit over here next to Sherry. Because out in the car, I have some of the juiciest steaks you'll ever see. And I brought some of that famous Tyler Texas barbecue sauce. Well, good. <laughs> Where's your other friends? Oh, they couldn't make it. They got too busy with work or something. Well, you're too busy to barbecue. You're just too damn busy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bill corrects me up. <laughs> well, come on. Let's go put those steaks on the grill. Give these girls a chance to get to know one another. It really cracks me up. Bill's a riot. Are you crazy bringing that girl up here? Yo, know, Amy's pissed. What the hell happened to you and, uh, and Lori? Nothing, hell, we're fine. Just, you know, every once in a while, us boys need a little vacation from the wives. Now, I told her that you and I were going golfing in Palm Springs. Hey, I bought my first set of clubs. Want to see them? Come on, be a pal. Cover for me. Why do you do this to me? <laughs> huh? Hey, Amy will settle down once she gets to know Sherry. Yeah, we'll see about that. She's a terrific gal. Don't tell me I didn't see you checking out that butt. <laughs> hey, she'll fuck you till your teeth rattle, too. Yeah, a girl like that, 
to take your heart and your youth and your hair. Yeah, as long as she don't take my money or my dick, I don't care. <laughs> Bill? Bill? Is that you? I hear you won the Damien Mason case. Yeah, I did. Congratulations. Thanks. Mm. <clears throat> Just between you, me, and the squirrels, uh, he was guilty, right? Yeah, aren't they all? Especially the ones that go free. But that's why I get paid the big bucks, right? So you're the one putting them criminals back on the street. Does that ever bother you? Fuck! If I get asked that question one more time, you know, I represent my clients as best I can, and I'm good at what I do. And if there are legal loopholes, well, then it's my job to exploit them. That's how the law works. Okay, shit. Are you a little tense today or what? Man, it's just that I get asked that question all the time. Hell, I don't make the laws. Yeah, just people getting tired of crime. Hell, I ain't blaming you. You know, we have the best judicial system in the world, and like everything else, it's not perfect. What's your answer, huh? You know, three strikes and you're out is not gonna work. Fuck three strikes and you're out. One strike and you're out. You commit a violent crime, adios, motherfucker. String him up by the balls, that's what I'd do if I was in charge. You're sure sounding ethical for a guy who's cheating on his wife. Ah, nobody's getting hurt. You tell that to your wife. <laughs> You are a good lawyer, aren't you? Ames, need some garlic salt. There you go. <coughs> say, uh, you're not going to say any glory about this, are you? Why shouldn't I? You're such a pig, Bill. God, you do all you're thinking with your dick. Well, to tell you the truth, Lori and I are having a little trouble. Oh, please, please. I am not one of the babes in the bar you just picked up, okay? Where is Sherry? She's upstairs, painting on her clothes. Doctor? Yeah. She's my new best friend. Oh, I didn't know I was going to get everybody so pissed off at me. Now I'm just trying to have a little fun. Oh, God. You know, the next time I talk to Lori, do you remember Lori, your wife? Yeah. Yeah. Well, if she asks me about this weekend, I'm going to have to lie to her. I don't like that. You are tempting fate, Bill. One of these days, your luck's just going to run out. Now, I want you to check this puppy out. Paid $900 for the whole set. Now, the guy at the shop said this club would take five strokes off my game. Yeah? Yeah, try it out. Give him a drink. There you go. <laughs> yeah. hit two balls that well since the last time I stepped on a rake. Stand back. Don't want to hurt you. Watch out. Fuck. 
hate this fucking game. Well, at least it went straight. <laughs> Where's my drink? Sherry! Ash will be up here in a minute. <laughs> Were you trying to get in the bathroom upstairs? No, I was not. I thought I heard something. Well, we were all down here. <sighs> you no, know, sometimes the wind blows the pine cones off the trees and they fall on the roof. Makes a terrible sound. It scares the bejesus out of you at night. Well, that didn't sound like no pine cone. That sounded like it came from your attic. I'll check it out. What was it? A rat. Oh, God. Would you do something with that? Oh, jeez. Alan, your, your mom said that there were more traps in the cellar. Oh, I don't want to go down there now. Besides, the food is getting cold. I didn't know you had a cellar. Well, it's just kind of like a basement with a trap door on the living room floor. Oh, hell. I'll go. No, it's real hard to get down into. I'll go. I'll go with you. Uh, I'll keep the food warm. And I'll drink my wine. <laughs> Mrs. Lassard? <laughs> you can call me Amy. I'm not that old. I understand how you feel about Bill and I. His wife is a good friend of mine. I know. And he really loves her. He's got a funny way of showing it. You know, if Lori found this out, it would kill her. She won't find out. Bill didn't even tell me he was married until we'd been out a couple times. I'm not trying to break up his marriage or anything like that. Shut up, must be the moisture. You carry a gun up here? What do you want me to do, shoot him? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, oh! You okay? Yeah. You want to go down there and get it? No, the hell with it. We can do this tomorrow. Whew. Help me cover the hole up. All right. <clears throat> Be careful. I don't want to lose you, Cass. Counselor. You expecting anyone else? No. Yeah. I didn't hear a car. Yes? He's in love, my brother. <laughs> I thought you couldn't come. Yeah, I mean, we couldn't afford to have to get out of L.A. Uh, we had been here an hour ago, but they had roadblocks on the 118, and, you know, no way are they going to wave through a black man with a white woman. <laughs> well, uh, Charles, this is my friend Bill Comish, Charles Shackman. Nice to meet you. This is my wife, Liz. Yeah, and this is yeah. uh, Sherry. Hi, yeah. Sherry. Hi, nice how to are you? you. Nice to meet you. Oh. <laughs> You're getting there. You're getting hey, there. look, um, we're just sitting down for dinner, so why don't you two take your bags upstairs? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, first door on the right, and we'll be down here. All right, okay. and we'll be right back. Hey. Okay. Look at you. What are you now? Seven months? Eight and a half. Eight and a half. <laughs> I'd forgotten why I hate you, and now I remember. I swear I was as big as you are now when I was two months. <laughs> Liz weighed over 200 pounds when she gave birth to Tanya. Mm. Oh. Mm. Fuck you, I'm tall. I can carry it. Well, you're not that tall. I mean, you'd have to be six foot eight to carry all that weight you put on. Wow. <laughs> hey, you better cheer. slap you. <laughs> Should you be traveling this far in your pregnancy? Doctor said I'm fine. I'm just going nuts, just sitting waiting, you know, waiting. How's the body feel? <laughs> you feel like a cow. <laughs> Even my feet are fat. <laughs> oh, your feet aren't fat. Your, your feet are cute. Shut up, they're fat. Okay, they're fat. <laughs> no, they're not. <laughs> oh. I remember. I've been through it twice. Yeah, where are the girls tonight? Oh, they're spending a the night with friends. They're at that age where they want to spend as little time as possible with mom and dad, you know? <laughs> well, I want to have some more of the steak. Have some Mom, you guys, oh, bring it no, here. No, we, we don't eat meat. Oh, you're shitting me. Nope. Mm. I'll bet you eat ribs. Yeah, uh, but only when I'm eating watermelon. <laughs> I, I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that. <laughs> There's plenty of salad and potatoes for you guys. You know, another reason we're late is because we, they made us take the 34, and that's about 20 miles longer. I wonder what all those roadblocks are for. Hmm? Yeah, something's going on. Well, probably drunk drivers. You know, the average IQ up here is about six. That includes me. <laughs> 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 I agree with that. Mm, when you said this place was secluded, you were not kidding. Hey, see, now you know why I go so stir crazy up here. Mm -hmm. I think it's beautiful. Beautiful hell, it's gorgeous. You know, that steak smells pretty good, actually. Oh, come on now. Oh, come on, it won't hurt no, you. No, no, no. no, no. Oh. One man's meat is another man's poison. As a matter of fact, I never eat anything that has a face. Oh. I'll bet that pisses your wife off. Oh. <laughs> I'd like to propose a toast to friendships, old and new. Here, here, man. Oh, I'm sorry, Ian. It's okay. Okay. Come on. Yeah. I have plenty of time to drink after yeah. this. That's right. Clink. This is very serious. It's been in the family for many, many years. Jello shooters now. Watch closely. <laughs> no. This is the best yet. Darling. I didn't know you could do that. 
<laughs> He's a professional. <laughs> oh, talk to me. You know, I always wondered what white people did for fun. <laughs> oh, now you know. Here we go. <laughs> Now turn your head around and spin it out. All right. <laughs> oh, you spent All a lot of money right. on that camera, oh, I bet you. Yeah. yeah that's yeah. a good one. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, that's it. There it is. There, perfect. All right, perfect. Yeah. Ready? <laughs> ah, I want two of those. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Best smile on. That's good. Hey. Yeah. Okay, look, Mama's gonna do it. All right. Uh, All right. Now everybody, getting close. Okay. Alright, try to look happy. Well, that won't be hard with all these beautiful yeah. women around. Yeah. You know what? I, I'm not going to be in the picture. Let me oh. take it. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, everyone, look happy. Scoot in. He's all right. All right. He's all right. All right. All right. One, two, three. Very nice. I have my best smile on them. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're looking good. Yeah. All right, well, uh, take one of the expecting couple. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, you look pretty. Uh, yeah. you do, you do, you do. Yeah. Right Did we get the baby in there? Oh my I'm God, sure I look a hundred years old in this. Oh. Oh. No, 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 no. You guys grandma. are black now with you. <laughs> Someone take a picture of Sherry and I. Go, ahead. Ahead. go for it. Go for it. There you go. There you go, baby. Ready? What's wrong? I swear there's someone outside. Oh, well, now, honey, we had enough scares for one night. Let okay. me take a look. <sighs> Nobody out there? No, try the door. Get away from the window. You can get in here. All the doors and windows are locked. Why didn't you answer the door? What are you doing with that? I didn't mean to scare you all, but there's been a little accident. I just came to get my friend. Where is he? What friend? Well, I left him here. What are you talking about? Well, it's been a little logging accident. He got cut up. He's bleeding pretty bad. <laughs> Couldn't just leave him out in the woods now, could I? So I picked the lock for you. Sorry. Anyway, uh, I got all messed up trying to find my way back to the truck. Well, it's been a little logging accident. You know, he got cut up. He's bleeding pretty bad. Well, your friend's not here. Well, maybe he's hiding. Why would he do that? Between us, he's a little slow. You know, maybe he got water in the brain, something like that. He probably got scared when you all showed up, thought he might get in trouble. Hey, Bobby! You know, he thought you might do something stupid. Like call the police. Bobby! Hey, man. What took you so long? I thought you left me. Oh. Hey, I got lost. How you doing there, Sheriff? Huh? I'm all right. Oh, man, you got a cigarette for me? Don't smoke in here. She's pregnant. I can see that. Do you mind if I help him? Why would I mind if you help him? 
Let's take your jacket off. No. Just let me look. This is a bullet wound. Well, you caught us. I said it was a logging accident, but it was a hunting accident. I didn't want you guys to think that we were a bunch of dumb shits, you know. We're gonna have to get to the hospital right away. I don't think so. What are you doing? He's gonna bleed to death. You just take whatever you want and leave us alone. Well, that's real generous of you. But I think we'll partake of your hospitality just a bit longer. Just take my car and go. Hey, man, cool, cool it. Push me. Cool it? Like just cool it, daddy -o? Don't you love the way the brothers have such a handle on the English language? We'll give you whatever you want. I'm just going to get my car keys. Well, if I only wanted your car keys, I'd have been gone by now. I want to stick around and get to know you folks. Chew the fat a little. Is it money you want? No. First of all, I want all your car keys. I don't want anybody leaving the party. And what the fuck are you waiting on? <clears throat> my, my keys are upset. Go! They're, go! They're about to go. Jaguar, Mercedes, and a... What the fuck is that? A Subaru? Shit. Now let me guess. The white guys have the Jaguar and the Mercedes, and the niggers stuck with the Jatmobile. Now, ain't that America? Well, now, how does that make you feel? Material things aren't important to me. Oh, bullshit. Who told you that? All the brothers I know want nice rides. You can't get good pussy without a good ride. Now, I bet you want a nice Cadillac. You'd be happy with a good old big Cadillac, wouldn't you? I bet you want a big old Cadillac so bad you can taste it. Woo! fix him up with I have a first aid kit in the car well, go get it I need the key to the door which one's yours the round one you would be lying to me now would you no, I swear. Now just remember, I'll have my gun aimed at that nappy head of your friend there. So don't try anything, okay?
I get the feeling that you people don't like me. I'm about to have my feelings. I don't feel so good, man. I need a doctor. I really need a doctor. Can't we get out of here? You want to spend the rest of your life in jail, huh? Can you fix him up? Fix this and take him to the kitchen. Get him out of my sight. Get him out of my sight! Listen, if you don't get to a hospital soon, you're not going to make it. He's only thinking of himself. No, he's not. He's really smart. If we left now, we'd go to jail. There's roadblocks all over the place. Look, if he gives you the gun again, hold it on him. I can get you to the hospital. I can get to the roadblocks. You're going to die if you don't get there soon. No way. The way we stay together. <laughs> Answer the door. I'm gonna move up, blow your head off, all right? Yeah, who is that? County Sheriff, we're conducting a search. Could you open the door, please? He's okay as long as I've got a hold of him. I'm sorry to scare you folks, but we're looking for a couple of men who've been involved in a murder up here. Have you noticed anything out of the ordinary around here? Uh, no, officer. I'm sorry. We can't help you. What's back there? Oh, he probably smells our steaks. <laughs> yeah, these damn dogs, they always go for the food. Yeah. Smells pretty good to me, too. Well, you all keep your eyes open, and if you see anything, give us a call. These men are extremely dangerous. We will. Thanks, officer. I noticed that uh, one of your car windows was broken. Oh, uh, yeah. Um... I locked my keys in the car. We had to break the window. Japanese cars were impossible to get into with a coat hanger. Next time, buy American. Y'all have a good night. Pow. Good boy. Okay. Let's see what you guys have. We'll get the luggage. Just have the nigger get the luggage, okay? Niggers are good at that kind of shit. Come on. Got all your wallets? My purse is in the kitchen. Go, go, go. Man, you sure are a fine thing, even with that big belly. Pregnant women turn me on. They really do. Huh. Not much of a haul. Must be the recession. Let's see what we got here. I want names and addresses. I don't want to lose touch with all you lovely folks. Now look at these two little pickaninnies. Must belong to you two, huh? Now what do you call them? White niggers? Be too bad if anything happened to them now, wouldn't it? Just throw it down here to Bobby, okay? Sit down. What we got here? What we got here? <coughs> Alan Lassard, Esquire, Attorney at Law. Well, enchanté. <coughs> A little dry for my palate. We've got an attorney with us. Just what the world needs more of. Attorneys. Hmm. You know Robert Harden? You talking to me? Well, yes, I am talking to you. I'm not talking just to hear myself speak. You know him? Yes. What do you think of him? 
good public defender. Yeah, he got me off a couple of times. The government paid for it, too. Huh, what else we got here? Huh. The curse. Terrible. Um, isn't this sweet? To Sharon Miller on her baptism day, love grandma. That is just so, so sweet, isn't it? What else we got here? An ACLU card. Now, what the fuck is that? The ACLU defends people against the government so that it doesn't infringe upon their rights. Well, I'm a victim of the system. I'll slip through the cracks. Maybe one day you can help me out. Then again, maybe not. Oh, what is this? Oh, my. Wait a minute. Where are you in this photo, huh, honey? That's your wife? She ain't much to look at, is she? Ugly. Now I get it. You better catch this. Between me and you, I don't think I could fuck her either. But this one's a different story. You look like one of those chicks from Babe Watch. I wouldn't have any trouble getting it up for you. Did your mother teach you in Sunday school that adultery's a sin? You're gonna burn in hell. But then again, won't we all? Shit. But maybe he's a cop. <coughs> well, they don't look like police issue. I don't think he's a cop. Are these yours? Or mine. My suitcase, ain't it? Well, of course, sir, you're slick. You like to play these little sex games at home, do you? Have trouble getting it up? Did your wife pack it for you and the fox? My guess is no. I bet you got a little dick, don't you? <laughs> you got a little dick there, big man? I think it is. What, if you can't uh, decide on a color, you just use them all? Is that the way this works? Woo! Yay. I think I like this. Hmm. What do you think, baby? Like this? Get a little bit of that? Hmm. Hmm. Well, boy. You are the life of the party, aren't you? Handcuffs and Peruvian marching powder. I like your style. You don't mind if I take a little bump here, do you? Give me that. You want some? Give me that. Hmm. Let's see. You. 
You still haven't answered my question, have you? You got a little dick? Huh? Why don't you show these people you got a little dick? Come here. Come here. Now, my friend here wants to show you how much of a man he is. Go up to the redhead. Go up to the redhead right here. Pull down your pants and show her your dick. Show her your fucking dick. Pull your pants down. Pull your fucking pants down. Please, man. I'm begging you. Don't do this. Pull them down or I'm gonna blow you away. What the fuck are you wearing? He's got girls' panties on. You do like to play games, don't you? <laughs> Grab his dick. Stop it! Shut up, you fool! You know I've got a murder rap already. I'll blow you the fuck away. You got that? Doesn't make any difference to me. I'll put you out of your misery. Now grab his fucking dick. Grab it. <laughs> That must not feel like much after you've been with Mandingo here, huh? Man, you're ridiculous. You're an embarrassment to the white man. Put it in your mouth. Damn you! That's enough! That's enough! That's enough! Get the fuck out of here! Take this! Handcuff these idiots. You're really hot in that big fancy car and all this money. You ain't that fucking hot. Now look what you did. Now look what you made me do. We didn't do anything to you, goddammit. Huh? You're crazy. You're nothing but white trash. The troopers will be back. They're gonna get you. See, I told you. 
<laughs> Look out the window. They're here. They're here. <laughs> They're here. <laughs> ah! Juno! Juno! One more step and I'll blow your fucking balls off! Yeah. Oh, this off me! Hurry! Go the other way, the other way, listen. Let me out! Give me the toolbox! Down there's got him. We'll be all right. Just go get the police. Oh, he's got our car keys, remember? Well, you'll have to walk. Oh, it's too far to walk. You'll never make it. <laughs> oh, oh, look out! Do you see him? I don't see anything. I gotta go down there and get the keys. See him? Yeah. Is he dead? He's not moving. Sorry, go in the kitchen and get me a knife. I'm going down. Are there steps? Yeah, there's a ladder. There. If anything happens down there, shoot him. You're upstairs. Oh, bullshit. I saw you put him in your pocket. I swear to God, they're upstairs! He says the keys are upstairs. See if you can find them. Maybe they're in his pocket.
I can't find them. Where are they? Huh? You let me go. I'll tell you where they're at. Okay. Where are they? Give me a fucking break, man. I tell you where they are, you leave me here and call the cops. Well, why don't I do that anyway, huh? Come on, turn over. Check your back pocket. Come on! Bad move, Chumley. Shoot him! Pull the trigger! <coughs> Pull the trigger, bitch! Oh. Pleasure. Since you can cover him up. Somebody's gonna pay for this big time. No, 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 no. Okay. Who did it? Did you do it? I didn't do it! I didn't ask you! It was me. Oh, it was you. Answer me! Oh, I'm sorry you got your mouth full. Huh? I've got one shot left. You willing to take this bullet for your friends? Huh? I don't think you did. I did. Are you scared? You ought to be a bad man. You're not a man. You're a pussy. <clears throat> oh, you feel like a man now. <laughs> I bet you take it up the ass. You like it up the ass, don't you? <laughs> you're a tough bitch, aren't you? You think you're a tough bitch? Show me your balls. There's the gun. Go for it. Go for it! Go for it! Charles going to town to get the police. 
What do you think you're doing? I'm going to get the police. No, you're not. Well, we got to get the police. Don't do it. Don't turn me in. Even in prison, I can reach you. I know where you live, and I know where you work. Whoa. You let me go right now, I won't tell anybody what you did to Bobby here. You shut the fuck up! Alan, you're upset, we can understand that. Maybe we're all in shock, but we gotta call the police. You're not going anywhere. I'm getting the police. No, you're not. What are you talking about? You're not going to the police. Then what do you think is going to happen? What do you mean? What do you think is going to happen to him once we go to the police? He'll be charged with rape and he'll be charged with murder. Oh, yeah, and uh, how much time do you think he'll serve? He'll never see the light of day again. Oh, dream on, not with our justice system. He'll be out in five years. But that's not our problem, is it? What? I'm sorry, but everybody is entitled to due process of law, including scumbags like him. Oh, come on, Alan, he's right. Do you think this low-life fuck has any remorse for what he's done? Huh? Don't puss out on me now. You're always preaching about capital punishment? Well, this is your chance. At least we've got this piece of shit off the streets. I say let's kill him. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, I believe in capital punishment, but not before a fair trial. Have you lost your fucking mind, huh? A fair trial? A trial is to determine proof of guilt. You watched him do it. How much more proof do you need? It shouldn't be us to do it. You know, listen, what could be more fitting, huh? The victims get the satisfaction of actually seeing the criminal executed, huh? Oh, that's oh, huh? illegal. What? Have, have you ever seen the people that sit on a jury, huh? They're fucking idiots. And all the intelligent people and all the people that have jobs make up stories so they won't have to be in court in the first place. Be personal. Oh, for God's sake, no. No, let's not upset him. It shouldn't be personal. Don't you think what he's done to us is personal? Alan, the man is sick! Oh, fuck. Fuck. Well, I don't believe you two. You're more concerned about this guy's rights than ours. This Sherry's got more balls than you two do. Well, fuck you guys. Fuck you guys. What do you think we should do? Kill him. Oh. There you go. <laughs> okay, let's say we kill him. What if we get caught? We won't. Look what you've turned into. You either give me the car keys or I walk. Close the fucking door. What are you gonna do, Alan? You gonna kill me? Look, you're not thinking clearly. Just let me handle this. Well, you're not going anywhere now, are you? You're a son of a bitch, you know that? I'm sorry, Charlie. This is ridiculous. You cannot force us to be your accomplices. Alan, you're, you're a prick. What are you doing? We've got to go to the police. I am not turning this asshole over to the police. I'm not going to let him do this to somebody else. We cannot take the law into our own hands. That's not what this country's about. If people didn't take the law into their own hands, blacks still wouldn't have the vote. Uh -huh. You'd be a slave, and you sure as shit wouldn't be married to a white girl. <laughs> you of all people should understand that. You better be careful, Alan, because your true colors are starting to show. Oh, shut up. Who would do it? Yeah. I don't believe it. You know, you're turning this into a lynch mob. Listen to me. Next time this guy gets out, maybe he'll rape your wife instead of mine. Huh. Hey, you want to kill him then? I can assure you of that. What am I going to tell Liz? Well, what he did was barbaric. Yeah, it was barbaric, but I refuse to be lowered down to his level. Would somebody tell me what we're going to do? Well, I can't stand it anymore. We better do something fast, because we already got one dead guy. 
Do I get any say in what's going on here? Huh? I just don't want to get caught. You're right. She's right. How would we get caught? Huh? We don't look like criminals. No, we don't. Do we have a motive? No. Do we have an alibi? Yes, we do. The troopers have already questioned us. They won't be back. Okay. Then let's do it. Let's do something. What about Liz? She won't stand for it. We're talking about murder, Alan. But it seems to me that she's the one that put the finishing touches on that other guy. What's she going to do? Turn us in? <laughs> what about your baby? You didn't think about that, did you? You're being a little selfish, don't you think? You think I wanted this to happen, huh? You think I enjoy this? As a matter of fact, I do! Stop it! Stop it! You get away you from here! You teachers don't get it, do you? It's like talking to a fucking wall! Do you think I'm ever going to be able to forget what happened here tonight, huh? My pregnant wife being raped right in front of my eyes while we all watched. My wife needed me and there was nothing I could do. None of us will ever forget what happened here tonight for as long as we live. And this <clears throat> asshole will be out on the streets within 10 years, guaranteed. Do you really think he'd get parole? You don't think murderers get out on parole? Of course they do. This is what I do for a living. I get guilty people off. There are two things that I can assure you of. One, they are never, and I mean never, remorseful. And two, they will do it again. Take it from me. They don't do anything to rape us. Our next door neighbor raped me when I was 16 years old. I went to the police, and no one believed me. <laughs> Not even my own parents. I told myself if I ever saw him again, I'd blow him away. If I thought he would get the death penalty for what he's done, I'd drive him to the fucking police station myself. People are who they are. They never change. Some people just have the devil in them. You know, born evil. Ellen, I don't remember you being so sensitive towards victims before this happened. Yeah, yeah. Well, I was wrong. I was just doing my job. I just wanted to win. You know, the laws aren't set up for justice. They're set up for the best lawyer. Who the fuck do you think makes the laws? <laughs> uh, look, like it or not, we're all in this together. I'm gonna go check out my wife. I'm sorry, baby. I love you. Did you kill that son of a bitch? For me. He's killed a motherfucker, okay? She's in shock. We're all in shock. Listen, you're in on this too. You and Sherry killed that guy. Don't you do this to me. Don't you do this to me. Charles, you're gonna have to make up your mind. Sherry. Kill him. Well, that's one to one. Now, my wife says kill him. Liz, what should we do? Well, now that's two to two. You know my vote, Bill. It's up to you. What do you say?
Then that settles it. I don't want any part of this. You think I do? You think this is easy for the rest of us? I don't want to look over my shoulder for the rest of my life, but you go ahead and bury your face in the sand. How are we going to do it? He lied. There ain't any bullets in this gun. Oh my God, you can't be serious. I found one. I ain't gonna do it. Give me that. I'll do it. Alan, don't do it! Reloaded. Think about it. He won't listen to reason. He's crazy. We took a vote and you lost. If you two want to leave, fine. I'm not going to leave Amy here alone with you. Do you want to go upstairs and lie down? Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Yeah. In my robe. I'll get it for you. Can I get a drink of water, please? Yeah, please. Um, I'll, I'll go downstairs get and get a drink of water. Oh. Everything's gonna be all right. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> what do you have to be sorry about? I didn't do more to help you. I didn't protect you the way a husband should. Oh, God, Amy, I feel so helpless. There's nothing anybody can do, right? Love you. Love you. <clears throat> what? Where's Charles? I said to watch the guy that Amy needed us. What? Okay, honey. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Can't do this. Charlie, this isn't right. Get out of the way. You're gonna have to run over me. You're losing it, Ellen. I've gotta do this. What the hell's the matter with you? What do you, you think you're doing? You can't do this hey. to me! He got away. How could he get away? He was handcuffed with his Achilles heel cut in two. He stole my car. Oh, great. So now what do we do? We go to police and we tell the truth. You won't get very far with the roadblocks. How's Amy? She's resting.
Did you really think you were gonna see me again, huh? I'm like a virus, I'm never gonna leave. <laughs> Enough, huh? You get the other guy's body and let's be done with this. You can't do it. You can't kill me. <laughs> Why not? I'll never get caught. <laughs> you can't do it. <laughs> you don't give, do you? It's not in you. It's not your nature. But it's mine. Why did you do this? Why do you want to make a lot of money? Why? Why so I can take care of my family? Bullshit! You do it for power. We both get off on that. Funny thing, though, you didn't look so powerful when I was fucking your wife, did you? Oh, you look kind of pitiful. I like that. Shut up, you bastard. You shut up, I'll kill you, I'll send you straight to hell. I'm already in hell. Don't you know that? Don't you know who I am? Look at my eyes. Look at my soul. It's evil. You don't want to kill me. You don't want to ruin your life. Don't do that. You kill my buddy, I'd say that's even, wouldn't you? When we have a bear call tonight, what do you say? You better put that barrel right between my fucking eyes. You got one shot you don't want to miss. Pull the fucking trigger. Sun's starting to rise. Copy, 
shut and patch the holes. Mm. You all right? Yeah, no problem. <laughs> it's just what you need, huh? Cool mountain there. Why are you leaving so soon? Oh, you know, business. You sure there's no way I can talk you into staying? No. What about all the nice furniture? Uh, furniture? Uh, sell it. Thank you. 